Burkert's launched a whole line of element sensors, pH, conductivity, and ORP. So what we're looking at here is our pH transmitter or on-off controller. For very simple applications where I want to just have a 4 to 20 milliamp and a relay output for either alarm, high or low alarm, or if I want to do on-off control, this is, this is the perfect transmitter. You can identify it by the, the stainless steel housing. This is element. This, this design is element. So if you're looking at a, at a Burkert isolation valve or a Burkert diaphragm valve or a Burkert pH transmitter, you'll notice the commonality of the design. The Element line of sensors is a very robust and high quality product. Incorporated into the transmitter is a display where I can see whether or not I've got an alarm condition, I can see whether or not the relay is energized or de-energized, and I can also see the system parameters. So if I'm monitoring pH or ORP, I'm going to see the value here. Another key feature is I do temperature compensation for both pH and ORP. If I don't need the display and I want to reduce costs, if I'm using the same product over and over and over again on the same machine, then I can take the programmer out, put that in the toolbox, and now that's a tool, and I put a blank cover over it, and it goes out as a truly blind transmitter scaled for the customer's application. So I'm doing control, on-off control, or alarm functions, and I'm also transmitting the value for the pH and ORP and the temperature. Okay, typically, you'll find a, a, an analog instrument out in the field and then a remote transmitter transmitting the value. Okay? In this case, this is replacing that. This is, this is the transmitter and the controller encompassed into one, one housing. For example, if I had a conductivity application where I wanted to control conductivity in a cooling tower, I'm going to have an electrode and I'm going to have a very expensive controller opening and closing a valve. This is the perfect solution for a low-cost cooling tower conductivity control loop. Another key feature to the line of, of transmitters, pH and ORP transmitters, is the flexibility of the, of the holder. I can literally put anybody's pH electrode into this transmitter. Anything with the PG13.5 connection will fit into this transmitter. An application such as reverse osmosis where I want to monitor both the pH and the ORP to the feet of an RO, I can use the same part number, the same inventory to do both of those applications. If I was doing on-off conductivity control, all I need is just the conductivity transmitter and a valve and I can do conductivity control. If I'm dosing pH on-off, I'd want to run a pump if I reach a low level, then this will also do that as well. Yes, I could, I've got two integrated transmitters that I can use to do on-off control or I can assign them as an alarm. Another feature for these transmitters is I can assign them for diagnostic capabilities. If I'm monitoring my electrode and over a certain period of time the electrode starts to foul, the impedance of the electrode will also change. It can be an indicator to the customer that he needs to come out and clean the electrode.